12th time the Stars and Blues get together in Dallas this season, and lately American Airlines Center has been the site of a surging Stars power play. Racing for it down low is Maroon. Stars defense keeps it away from him. Spezza slides it to Haskin, and he overskated. Maroon's back in with a step, a shot, save made, rebound loose. Hudobin doesn't have it. It was at the side of the crease, and then squirted wide. An opportunity for a first period lead here. Lindbergh weaves in to Ben. Shot from the slot at the top of the crease. It's eaten up by Bennington. Colton Pareko slowly ahead. Through a slash from Foxa. A hand ahead for Schwartz to the inside. Now O'Reilly winds, fires. And getting a piece with the glove was Hedobin. And O'Reilly leans into this one. It just caught the cuff or the cheater of the glove of uh, Hudobin, who was in windmill form on that, to make sure this stays scoreless in the morning has affected John Klingberg. He blocked that shot in Tampa Bay, trying to protect it and rest him a little bit. There's Haskin in. Sets across a shot, score! Stick play to Jamie Benn with a drive-by. He flips it past Bennington to open the scoring. That's a skilled play on both ends. It has been a month for the ages for this St. Louis team. Here's Fox that carries back in. Feeds to Como, delays, and then a bit by Lindell in front is scored by Fox. And the Stars checking line of Fox, Como, and Benn has scored twice here in the second period. Pareko has nothing but a bag of fresh air in front of the net as Foxa spins, rattles a backhand home. An errant pass goes right to Sagan, the wide turn at center, and he'll re-enter. Leaves for Radula. Pulls, shoots, scores! the screen he rips it right past the ear of Bennington now cuts to the inside it just rolled off his tape and a long reach by Hudobin swept it to the wall O'Reilly flipped in front of shot score wow. what a setup by O'Reilly and the beat goes on for Vlad Tarasenko this is almost as sweet as the Miro Haskin and set up for Ben at the other end Ben took a hit up high Trying to protect, shoving with Edmondson. Prison rules. Here's Liddell, a shot, score! Ben maybe got a piece, and the Stars are back up by three. Quick snapshot by Liddell, perfect deflection. Wonderful hands by the captain. The stars are up by three again. And now in front, a shot stopped, and then the rebound sent just wide with O'Reilly and Schwartz digging. Full Meester from distance, a shot stop, rebound, O'Reilly scores. With 22 seconds left in the period, Ryan O'Reilly gets the second for St. Louis and once again cuts it to two. A little more comfortable. Three on three, enter the Blues in a shot glove, save Hudobin, he doesn't have it secured and it's wrapped to the corner. Played over. Bennington high slot, Sunquist shorthanded, races in, and a shot blocked by the stick of Klingberg. Again, the Stars have done great work tonight. Guarding the middle, oh, look out! Petrangelo, and he had trouble with it, a second effort, Barbashev, and Hudobin, and oh goodness, what a mess that turned into quickly. The perfect amount of touch from Lindell. 50 seconds remain, Stars lead is still two. Poked away at center, Sagan catches up for the end net goal off of some wonderful work defensively and in neutral ice and salt this thing away. Four goals from Ben, Radulov and Sagan combined and an 11 game franchise best winning streak goes up in smoke as the Stars beat the Blues. While their captain played a prime role tonight, Hudobin really bowed up in the pipes and the St. Louis Blues made them earn it, and they earned every inch of it here tonight.